I've been thinking hmm? about your young man. Reed? Why? I would like to honor him in some way. And, but I don't know what he would have liked. Would I, should I give some money to the Euro Wing? Should I endow a, a fellowship in his name? I'm not so sure he'd go for an endowment, but I'd like it. I want him to be remembered. Ah, oh, I wish, I wish, I wish that I got to know him. Uh, well, you would have liked him. You guys are actually very similar. Well, for his sake, I hope not. Why? Grandmother, what did you do now? I learned something. I learned something when Reed died. And what I learned is that life is short. There's... No time to waste with holding grudges or, or holding back. So you need to go to mom and try to make this right. I won't be welcome. Well, who cares? You have to at least try. Well, I, I, I mean, I, it's over. Grandmother, from her point stop, of view. stop, I, stop I, making I, I excuses. Would, go. I have to Just go? Just go to mother, please. All right, I'm going. Please. I'm going. Thank you. Hello. Hey. What was that about? She and my mom got in a fight, and she thinks it's all right to never speak with my mother again, apparently. Oh, I'm sure she doesn't No, she can't like... give up, Noah. Reed never gave up. No, hey, I know. Luca, I know. It's just... When he died, he was so calm. Like, he was like, I'm going to die. Just, just take my organs. Like, that's all there was to it. Like, like he didn't matter. Like, we didn't matter. Hey. At the end, who did he want to talk to? Like, who did he want to be with? You. He was brave. He was a good man. Yeah. He was. I wish uh, we could all be like Reed. Can't believe that Reed's gone. I mean, it has to count for something. He saved Chris Hughes' life. Yeah. And Chris is doing okay? You know, there's been no rejection problems, right? Not one. And everybody else that got Reed's organs is doing well, too. So, um, yeah, we can keep going with this, because this is helping. Well, good. I mean, think about all the patients who will use the neuro lab. You know, that was Reed's brainchild. Yeah. I'm going to make sure it is the finest facility in the country. What? You, you're just, um, I don't know, you're so much more focused, you know. You're not the, you're not the same Luke I met back at WAK. That kid who didn't know who he was or what he wanted, you know. So you figured it all out, huh? <laughs> For now, maybe. So when are you going to L.A.? I've got something I need to give you. Oh, um, well, there's, there's no rush for that. And in fact, I should, I should, uh, probably get back around the counter. Wait, 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 what are you doing? Does it look like him? Going back to work. The hell you are. Don't you dare do this for me. Don't give up the chance of a lifetime to sit around here and hold my hand. I'm not doing that. Well, then what is this about? You were there for me. I lost my sight, Luke, and you spent every waking hour taking care of me, researching surgeons and therapists, doing everything for me, up to and including cutting my own food. Yeah, but I didn't give up my dream. But you would have. If it would have helped, yeah, I would have. But Noah, this is not gonna help. Reed is still gonna be gone. And I'm still gonna be grieving. And if anything, it'll make me feel worse because I'll feel like I'm stealing from you. Okay, let's let's just talk about this after my shift is over, okay? Yeah, but I thought you were supposed to fly to LA today. Do will you still have your ticket? Will you pipe down? Okay, you're gonna get me fired. Good! Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, you are gonna have to find somebody else to make lattes because this guy, this guy has to go be the next Spielberg. Okay, it's Scorsese. Whatever. Whatever. Uh. Luke. Come on, what is this? What you've always wanted. What I've always wanted since it came out on the market like five minutes ago, but this is too much. Actually, it's only the beginning. Wait till you get to L.A. and see all the film stock my mom got you. Oh, what, is your dad gonna send me out a horse? Recording equipment? No. Noah, we believe in you. All of us. So you have to get on that plane and you have to go to L.A. and you've gotta make your movie. All right. But I want 
one condition. Shoot. You take a break from building your beautiful new hospital wing and you come visit me on set. Will I be able to eat out of those uh, craft service carts? <laughs> Will you settle for uh, that hot dog place you like on the Brea? <laughs> Deal. <laughs> so, we are gonna do our goodbyes here. Well, it's where we first met. Yeah. That's where we had our first kiss. I'm not gonna ask you to come with me, even though it would be great to have you there. I can't. I know. Look, I didn't know Reed for very long, and it may seem like I'm making more of it than what we actually had. Luke, I, I get it. You, you loved him. It wasn't some infatuation or a fling, it was real, and you need to honor that. Yeah. And him. You do get that. I love you. No, I... And that's why you need to stay here and just do what you need to do. You know, grieve and, and heal. Okay. And maybe one day soon, when and if you're ready, Get on a plane and I'll be waiting.